Camera has speed and sound has speed. Interfacing the ICOM 7300 and N3FJP logging software. Take 49. Hi, I'm Faith Anna, AU4FH, and welcome to hamradio.world. Tomorrow, starting at 1900 Zulu time, Winter Field Day is on. We have invited new hams, old hams, and inexperienced hams to come and operate. But one of the last things we have to do to make sure we're ready is to make sure our ICOM 7300 works with the N3FJP software that we have. So we're going to take a USB port, plug it into the computer, take the other end and plug it in into your IC7300, turn on your IC7300, wait for it to turn on so you can see if anything needs to be fixed, and it does not look like it, but if anything up here, around here, comes up on your computer, you should probably check into that because it's probably supposed to be there but sometimes it's not so you should check just to make sure but nothing's going on on ours so I'm going to push setting rig interface since we're using an ICOM 7300 we're going to push ICOM we find that 9.6 baud rate works for our radio and change the 6 in this number sequence to a 9 oops to a to a 9 <laughs> sorry I'm still getting used to doing this um, and the six in this one to nine as well. And we are going to be starting it on COM port four and seeing if it works. So it did not get the mode or the frequency. It did not receive that. So let's try COM port 20. It got the frequency and it got the mode and it's the same as here. So we can change it here to um, see if it works. I'm going to do seven megahertz and it changed to seven. What about lower sideband? Changed to lower sideband. How about Riddy? It changes to Riddy. And since Daddy likes sevens, I have a special treat for him right here. 7.777. And it changes to that. But I'm going, but this is outside the handband, so don't operate there. I'm going to put it on a handband now that technicians can use. 28.315. And it changes. Once you're done setting up to make your radio work with the software, which is what this page is about, you're going to push done. And if you change your frequency here, after a few seconds, it'll change to the frequency that it is. So it changed to the frequency. And if you have your N3FJP software set up to have a um, DX cluster down here, you can um, see oh look I want to talk to that guy and you can push it and it'll change your rig to the frequency but we don't have that so I can't show you what it does but um, if you're having trouble with yours then you should go to n3fjp.com to see if he has an explanation for how to fix that thing that's going wrong on yours but that's it for now 73